Hi everyone, uh, I'm Andreas from iGrow. We are building the world's largest organic farm, funded by you. My mother's family were farmers, but they have problem to get proper income because they don't have enough capital and land. And they are not alone. In Indonesia, there are millions underemployed farmers, while in other side, there are millions of hectares underutilized land, and millions of people ready to participate in farming. That's why we create iGrow. We connect between the farmers, landowners, and investors together to create farming, and we sell the crops directly to the buyers. We are raising capital from you through our website and apps, and we give you farm feel like experience so that you can know how your plantation grow. And after the harvest time, we share the profit among investors and farmers. Just from peanut alone, we already harvested 1,600 tons of produce that bring 24% annualized return to the investors, and 99% of them reinvested in us. Before we start planting, we always secure the deal with our buyers. Our buyers consist of the, big, the biggest producers, uh, uh, food producers in Indonesia, and also one of the biggest supermarkets like Carrefour. We also export the food outside Indonesia. Since launching two years ago, we already profitable by making 1.6 million US dollar GMV, and we take 20% of that for our profit. We can also get revenue in the long run from the profit of crop selling, agro-tourism, bioeconomic products, and the carbon trading. Currently, we are working with 2,200 farmers in 3,000 acres underutilized land. We already made our farmers' life better, and we changed the way how we utilize our idle land. We are in Indonesia with 40 million acres underutilized land, and we already had 24,000 acres in our pipeline. We are also ready to scale to another country. We already established partnership with our local partner in Turkey and Japan. We want to open uh, farming location in there with their farmers in their our land. We are also preparing partnership with Malaysia, Thailand, Brazil, and Canada. The more we can get access with the country, the more uh, uh, the more powerful we can address the supply and demand of the agriculture products in the world. We are trying to move the capital focus from the financial transaction like bank, insurance, and capital market into the real sectors that address the real basic problem like food security. It's time for everyone to get access to their uh, investment so that they can know their money do related with the food production, land utilization, employment, and the environment. Our team consists of serial tech entrepreneur, 10 years experience in agriculture, and the expert in land partnership. We already invested by 500 startups and East Ventures, and already recognized as one of the most disruptive solutions in agriculture domain. So together with landowners, farmers, and you, let us build the world's largest organic farm by making our world a better place. Thank you. Good very, job, I grow. Very impressive uh, social mission. I have just one quick question, which is um, how does the money flow? Hmm. How does it work so that how do you ensure that when the buyers buy the goods, the investors get paid? Hmm. Yep. First, the investors give the money to us, and we manage the money. We give it to the landowners, we give uh, as a lease income for the landowners, and we give to the farmers every month. Uh, so we work with a uh, farmers group. In Indonesia, we have a lot of farmers group, so it's easy to manage the farmers with the farmers group. And also, uh, we send the surveyors that control and monitor the quality of the farmers' job there. And after the harvest time, all of the produce, we will distribute it uh, directly to the buyer. So we cut all of the middlemen in the agriculture. So that's why our profit is higher than another producers, another farmers. So that's why we can uh, give the return, the high return to the investors. And we also secured the, the investment. So when farmers sell the goods to their buyers, how do you know where the transactions are and how do you get a cut? Hmm. Uh, actually, uh, we, we put the, the person in, in the land. So the, the, the person will get in charge to monitor all of the activity uh, uh, for, uh, in, 
uh, actually in, 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 the, in the harvest time. And the farmers also get the profit sharing. Uh, almost 40% of the income from the uh, crop selling goes into the farmers. So the farmers have the ownership. So that's why they will have the credibility and also the, the good quality of the job. But do you, to follow up on Hans' question, mm. do you sell, does Igro sell to your buyers mm. or does the farmer sell directly to the I buyers? Igro sells. And that's how we they own the, the, the supply the chain. We all own the network to the buyers. So the, the farmers they, uh, don't have the access to that. Okay. Um, and following up on that as well, is that, so you have three primary groups, right? There's farmers, there's investors, and there's buyers. Mm -hmm. uh, which one of those groups is, is the hardest to acquire, or which one is the scalability bottleneck, mm -hmm. and how are you going to address that? The, the hardest part is finding the investors, actually, like now. Uh, the second part is finding the buyers. So uh, the, uh, first, we must find the buyers, and then we can plan anything. Because uh, it's very easy to find the farmers, and it's very easy to find the, the landowners. Every day, we get phone from the landowners offer their land to be managed by iGro, and also the farmers to be managed by iGro. So uh, we have a lot of pipeline in terms of land and farmers. But uh, we have a uh, lack of capability to uh, collect the, the capital. So Because we need uh, working capital before we start planting. Uh, because uh, before we, we release, release the opportunity in our website, we must make sure that we already clean the land, we already uh, buy the seed, we already prepare the farmers ready to work in the land. So we need working capital, maybe for one up to three months, and after that, we, it will recover back from the in, man, investor money. Uh, after that, we can move into the, another location for the land expansion. Well, organically, with our current profit, we can grow almost 80 to 100 acres a month. Uh, but when we can get fundraising, more money, we can get more working capital to expand more expense, uh, exponentially. And how do you encourage or attract the buyers? I mean, do they come to you? Because uh, it's normally like the demand is from places where they do need more like organic products or whatever. Mm. What is the main reason for them to work with iGrow? Yeah, the first value proposition is uh, we, are, we produce organic, organic product. It's very hard to find organic product uh, with the, the high quality and high quantity. Usually, uh, small farmers only produce a small number of, uh, of organic, uh, organic uh, produce, uh, but iGro can produce a, a, a very high quantity and very high quality. So that's why our buyers intend to buy from, for, uh, to iGro. And uh, we also compete, can compete with the price uh, with another, another competitors. I, I guess it's no surprise that the, of the, the three different sides of the marketplace, uh, investors are probably harder to attract. So what are you doing to increase the number of investors that are putting money onto the platform, as well as maybe getting the current investors to put more money in? Yeah, right now, all of our investors come from individual investors. But uh, since last month, we uh, have planned to also acquire investors from the big company that have endowment fund or also uh, the, the retirement fund. Uh, for example, we come to Korea, approach Samsung and Hyundai for this month uh, until December to uh, move the money in CSR or another endowment fund uh, to put in uh, Indonesia agriculture. So it becomes the efficient strategy to collect the capital in the short term uh, as, uh, while we uh, build the credibility in terms of individual investors. So the more individual investors join iGro, the more powerful our credibility to approach the bigger or uh, the, the big company. You are a rocket internet company? Sorry? Are you invested by Rocket Internet? No, 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 no. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, this is another slide, I think. Yeah, that's all, that's oh. all the time we have for iGrow. Good job, iGrow. Thank you very much.